class. Go ahead and do a reading right now. All right. So, can we switch to math for just a minute? We're going to do a little bit of math. Who likes math? All right, good. So, help me out. How old are you? Five. Six. Five. Six. Seven. Six. Seven. Well, let's see. Now, what, what year is it? Do you know what year it is? 2010. 2010. So, I write that this way, right? Two zero one zero, right? Yeah. Is that right? Yeah. That look right? Yeah. Well, you just did four and your two properly. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> oh. yeah. Don't, my penmanship is awful. I, you got to do better than I did on penmanship. All right, I'm really bad. I didn't do the two right, did I? Well, just imagine it's a two zero one zero. Okay, that's two thousand ten. I should get somebody else to come up here and write it. You want to write it? Will you write it for me the right way? Will you write 2010 up there the right way? That is better. Much better. Much better than mine. Okay, so now, um, who wants to come up and write another number for me? Will you come up and write another number for me? Put right under there. Two zero um, Get the point five zero. Two, two, right two. under it. And then a zero, and then a five, and a zero. You know what I just figured out? I should have done this the other way around. Hey, will you do it one more time for me? Will you do it? I, I messed up. Will you put it? Can you reach high up there? How high can you reach? Oh, you can. Okay, good. Write the same number right up there on the top. I'll sort of lift you up. Oh, you got it. I'll keep your sleeve out of there. You're doing great. I'm making you right tippy toe, we're not. Five. Five. Who does it right? And a zero. Perfect. Now, you already do some big math? Watch this. Now, watch this, Elijah. We're going to put a minus sign over there, right? I haven't been there yet, Bob. <laughs> this is a little bit of a tough thing, okay? This, you know what it ends up being? 40 years, from 2050 Elijah. to today. Elijah. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Okay, so from 2050, I'm going I'm to go talk to uh, Channel 4 about this 2050 thing. From today is 40 years, right? So now, how old are you again? How old are you? Five. Five? And you're? Six. Six? Five. Five? Six. How old are you? Let's pick six, all right? Six. Let's say you're six in 2010. No. Right? This is this year, and some of you are five, some of you are seven, some, most of you are six, I take it. Okay, so if you add the same number, 40 uh, years to this, right? So we're going to say you're six in 2010, in 2050 you'll be 40. Or it's 40 years from now. So that means that in... 2050, you'll be 46 years old. Lord willing, we all live that long, right? So, 46. What do you think you're doing at 46? You gotta, you, how old's your mother? Oh, wait a minute. Don't answer, don't answer that. Don't strike that. Strike that. <laughs> how, how old's your dad? He wouldn't mind me asking how old he is. How do you think your dad is? Your dad's how old? 35. 35. My dad's That's right. 38. 38. Okay. How old's your dad? 40. Um, 40. You got a 40 year old dad? Uh, okay, so just imagine this. It's right now 2010. I'm going to go back in the back where you're talking about 2050 and some numbers for the federal government, right? That's 40 years from now. You're six years old right now. 40 years from now, you're going to be 46 years old. You'll have your own Elijah at Hampton Park. Won't that be amazing? You'll have your own. Uh, son or daughter, maybe, at Hampton Park. And so you'll be 46 when all of what I'm talking about in the back of the room is happening. That seems like a long time for now, doesn't it? But we got to figure out how to make sure that uh, your future at 46 is as good as your 40-year-old dad's has been. So uh, that's what I'm going to go talk about back here in the back.